Let's take a look at our next lesson. Count groups of tens and ones up to 20. It says count the clovers. Now type the missing numbers. I'm going to count the clovers and circle any groups of 10 as I count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Great. Now I have 1, 2, 3. So I have 110 plus how many ones? 1, 2, 3. 3 ones is equal to how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 110 plus 3 ones is equal to 13. And that makes sense because there is a 1 in the tens place showing us that there is just 110, and there is a 3 in the ones place. Great. So I know that 110 plus 3 ones is equal to 13. Next, they would like us to count the pictures. I will count and circle any groups of 10 as I go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4. All right, so I know I had 1, 10 plus 4, 1s, which is equal to, well, I know there will be a 1 in the tens place and a four in the ones place. So that is 14. Let's count to double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Absolutely. So one ten and four ones is equal to 14. Now, let's count the bananas. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Great! Now let's count this group. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Brilliant work! Alright, so I can see that we have two tens. We have two groups. Here's one group of ten and two groups of ten. How many ones do we have left over? Do we have any left over down here? No. Zero. So I know there is a two in the tens place and a zero in the ones place. So my answer is 20. We can also count by tens to make sure that that is true. 10, 20, yes. 20 is the correct answer. So two tens plus zero ones is equal to 20. Next, let's count the clovers. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so how many tens did I circle? Yeah, none, zero. How many ones did I put a line under? One, two, three, four, five. Five ones. Well, I know that we're not going to have anything in the tens place, but I do know there will be a five in the ones place. So that is equal to just five. Zero tens and five ones is equal to five. Now let's count the fire trucks. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so how many tens did I circle? Absolutely zero. Zero tens plus one, two, three, four, five, six ones is equal to what? Yeah, six. Great, let's find this down below. Zero tens plus six ones is equal to six. This says six tens plus zero ones. No, that would be 60. Zero tens plus six ones, yes, is equal to 18. No, 18 
No, we definitely didn't count up to 18. Zero tens plus six ones is equal to six. Ah, yes, this looks correct. Let's double check this one just to be sure. Six tens and, oh, I can already tell this one's not correct because we did not have six tens. All right, we found our answer. Now, let's count the bananas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, how many tens did we circle? Yeah, zero. So let's cross off any options that do not have zero tens. This does not have zero tens. And this does not have zero tens. All right, this one says zero tens plus eight ones, that's true, is equal to 20, or zero tens plus eight ones is equal to eight. Which one is correct? Yes, this one down here because we definitely did not count up to 20. This is not 20 bananas, this is eight bananas. All right, next they would like us to count the oranges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Brilliant. And we have one, two, three extra. So I know that we have one ten plus three ones. And what is that equal to? Well, let's see, I know there'll be a one in the tens place and a three in the ones place. 13, that makes sense because we have 10 circled and then 11, 12, 13. So let's find this sentence below. Do you see that number sentence? Me too. It is right here. 110 plus 3 ones is equal to 13. All right, let's count the boats. You can count with me if you'd like. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Great. And next, we have the ones. 1, 2, 3. So I have 110 and three ones. Do you know how much that is equal to? This one might be kind of difficult, but try and think of it in your mind. One ten plus three ones would be how much? Yes, 13. So can you spot the correct number sentence down below? Yes, right here, one ten plus three ones is equal to 13. Brilliant work. All right, how many skateboards is that? I'm not going to draw a line under it because I can see it is just one. Now, did we circle 10 skateboards? No. So we know that there will be zero tens. So I'm going to cross off any options that don't say zero tens. All right, so we have zero tens plus one one is equal to 12, or zero tens plus one one is equal to one. Which one sounds most reasonable? Absolutely, this option down here. Now this problem says, count the action figures. Now choose the best answer. Well, I can see that there is just one action figure. So I did not circle 10 action figures. So any options that do not say zero tens, I'm going to cross off. Great. Now, does it seem reasonable to have zero tens plus one one is equal to one? Or zero tens plus one one is equal to 15? A 15 does not make sense. So this is our correct answer. You did an amazing job, my friends. 